The next Geetam is in Mohana Ragam, Varavina Mridupani. This is set to Rupakatalam. First, I will show you the Arohana Avarohanam of Mohana Ragam. Sari Gapada Sa Sa Da Pa Kari Sa Now, first, I will play the Geetam. In Swaras and Anjani will repeat it. Ga ga pa pa ga pa sa sa ki sa da da pa ga pa ga. Now I'll play the Geetam with Sahityam. Garavina Rudupani Panaruhalo Janarani Suruchirakam Garavini Suranutakam Now we will come to Swarajati. Swarajati comes after Geetam. Swarajati has Pallavi, Anupallavi and Charanam. Pallavi is the first portion of the Swarajati. Anupallavi is the second portion and the rest comes under Charanam. That is the third portion. This Swarajati is composed in Rag Kamas and set to Aditalam. Raga Kamas is a Janya of Harikambodhi Ragam. First, I will play the Arohanam and Avarohanam of Kamas Ragam. 
ಸಮಗಮನಿ ಪದ ನಿ ಸನಿದ ಪಮಗರಿ ಸ Uh-huh. 
ऐसा नहीं था will come to the varnam this is usually the first piece of a concert i'll be playing ninu kori and mohana ragam set to adi thalam <laughs> Thank you. 
श्री भास
I'll be presenting concert pattern. Veena is a solo instrument used as a main solo instrument, generally accompanied by mridangam and sometimes upapakavadhyam like ghatam, kanjira or morsing. Today's artist on the mridangam is Delhi Shri S. Sairam. We will be presenting a kriti in the raga Jagan Mohini. It is Shobhillu Saptaswara. This Kriti is composed by Shri Tyagaraja, set to Rupakatalam. <laughs> Ah. Uh -huh. 
What I would like to tell people who are practicing Veena, who are aspiring to become Veena artists is to practice, practice and practice. The harder you practice, the more perfect you are. Like I believe in the saying that practice like a devil and play like an angel. So it's hard work that pays. I would especially recommend the Tristai which I had played, which I had shown in my basic lessons. The practice of Tristai and the three columns of um, Varnams or Geetams are very very helpful for control of instrument and also to practice music for the sake of music. There are three types of music approaches. The first approach is practicing music for the sake of divinity, to attain divinity like how the Mumurtis, the three composers Saint Tyagraja, Sri Muthuswami Dikshitar and Sri Shama Shastri, they have attained salvation through music. That is the best approach to music. The second best approach to music is to learn music for the sake of music, for the sake of art. And the third approach, much lower than the first two, is to um, practice music for the sake of material gains. And for professionals it may be good, but I would always recommend that one should follow the first two paths at least soulfully and to practice all the time and practicing music in Brahma Muhurta is very very effective to wake up very early in the morning by 4 or 4.30 and pray, uh, uh, practice at that time that yields a lot of results that yields double results to what you practice in the daytime. I thank Mr. Naveen Daswani of Super Audio Company for giving me this opportunity to share whatever I know about Veena. It has been a great pleasure sharing all this with you. Thank you.